channel, we're Dos Cavazos, and we're watching Stranger Things Season 4, Episode 3. So there's a lot of stuff going on right now. Murray and Joyce are presumably going to go pay this ransom to get Hopper mm -hmm. out of jail in Russia. They're going to Alaska, I'm assuming. But we also have a whole lot of other storylines going on right now. There's something to be said about what Dustin and Eddie were talking about, talking about this curse. Uh, but I also kind of feel like, you know, Eddie's uh, uncle... What he was talking about, this killer who like killed, I guess that was like his calling card about pulling out the eyes or like gouging out the eyes. I feel like there's some sort of combination between the two. So with this new creature this season, um, we don't know exactly what his motivations are. Mm. Why, how is he picking people? It seems like he's like preying on people's weaknesses. Yeah. Potentially, or their fears more so than anything potentially. But is he a part of the upside down? Probably, but like how, you know. That's why I feel like it's a person who mm -hmm. made their way into the Upside Down and possibly combined with some sort of creature in there. We saw like what the creature was doing to Fred in the last episode, and it seems like, you know, he was involved in like a car accident. I feel like at some point in time, it's probably going to be Nancy who's going to kind of find out I'm assuming that she's probably going to go to the asylum that Eddie's uncle told her about. Mm -hmm. And then maybe we'll kind of see like a connection as to like why the person, that killer, was killing the, the people that he killed. Maybe that way it'll like kind of compare like to what we're doing right now with Chrissy and both with Fred. We also keep flashing back to when Elle was in the rainbow room and the incident that we saw at the beginning of this season. I don't know. I mean, obviously we're left to assume that she killed everybody. I want to hope that she didn't, but I also think that it's possible that you know she did it and then repressed those memories and then like when incidents happen when I believe her name was Angela Casey was calling her Debbie for a couple episodes she her name's that, Angela <laughs> yeah she, she said that she acts or looks like a Debbie she looks like a Debbie okay. not acts like a Debbie I, mean, I don't know a Debbie all the Debbies are gonna like come at me <laughs> I don't know I'm how just like she Debbies just looked like her name would be Debbie like well, regardless you know. <laughs> when that whole incident like arose and like she hit her in the face with like the skate it kind of sparked the memories of that like, that whole incident from the very first scene of this season. I feel like it's going to keep on happening, but I feel like it's only a matter of time before Elle gets her powers back. All right, well, if you haven't already, don't forget to like and subscribe and check out our Patreon if you want to see our full-length reactions to this series. We also do have a second channel, Dos Cavazos IRL, where we do vlogs and other non-reaction content. We actually just went to MegaCon Orlando recently. We filmed some videos over there, so if you want to check those out, links down below. All right, let's jump into this episode. My grandma used to have that strainer. <laughs> or strainer really similar. Oh goodness. Alien abduction is this? Oh, it's a helicopter. <laughs> oh, it's this guy. Okay. Are they bringing him in for the killings? There were no oh signs. Oh my gosh. Everything that has happened in Hawkins can be traced back to Brenner's little pet. Wouldn't you agree? Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> Remote assassinations. Oh wow. So I thought she was her. a spy. Why are you taking that box? Those are Peter's old school projects. You do not need those. Are they though? <laughs> At least they had a convenient place for the helicopter to land. <laughs> I want to know everything he's done and everyone he's spoken to in the past year. And if we're lucky, he'll lead us right to the girl. What's he been up to in his retirement? Mm. Back at the roller rink. Can you tell me your name? Oh, <gasps> Angela. Angela. It's Debbie. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh, they're all looking at... It's really awkward. Yeah. I know this may be like upsetting and shit, but that future prom queen is gonna be fine. <laughs> <laughs> plastic. Oh. Not like hard plastic, just just a soft kind. Mm -hmm. Total. But you ever wonder why the wheels aren't wood, man? What? It's so people don't get hurt when they get smacked. <laughs> yeah, because it happens more than you think, man. Roller skate attacks. <laughs> I still feel like she should have grabbed the camcorder and done it with that. Oh. <laughs> Isn't this just like a stoner conversation <laughs> between them? A little blip. That's a funny word, man. Blip. Blip? Don't tell that to Marvel. <laughs> <laughs> Not so funny to them. Blip, blip, 
Are they high now? <laughs> Did Joyce even leave them a note? <laughs> oh, yeah? Like, off to Alaska, Hopper might still be alive. Well, well! Oh. Aren't you out of sight for sore eyes, huh? Hi, Murray. You kids like risotto? Did they not leave yet, or did she go alone? Didn't the buyers move here? Small world, isn't it? Oh, They're not yeah, saying. Yeah. Sweeter of you to let me stay. <laughs> and he cooks, too. Mm. And cleans. Buy this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> stay. I'd be tempted, Joyce. But they don't want to give him false hope, you know. Mm -hmm. I almost forgot to tell you guys a conference tomorrow. Take charge while I'm gone. Yeah. Wait. What? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Out of his mind right now. Going to Alaska? <laughs> mm -hmm. What's going on in Alaska? The Britannicas are there. Yeah. <laughs> Lelouch. <laughs> With you. I don't think I know what's wrong with you. <laughs> Super stressful day. Stress, huh? This girl got smacked in the head today. Oh my, oh gosh. my gosh. But it wasn't like an ice skate. It was, um, it was a plastic skate. Mm, no, it was like rubber. Rubber, rubber, rubber. Oh my god. Anyway, she yeah. she looked like she's gonna be fine. She's totally fine. She didn't look fine. Oh, oh. Mike, no. What are you doing? What's going on, you guys? Okay. I, uh, I sense tension. <laughs> Is it the risotto? Everyone hates the risotto. <laughs> That's incredible. It's risotto. It's smacking me. <laughs> Still have no idea who he is. <laughs> <laughs> this random guy. He's new this season. Yeah. He's off to a good start. <laughs> what do you do? What do you do? Angela! Oh my uh. gosh. What have you done? Oh, the upside down? Is this where the creature's at? There's just like bats that live in the upside down. This is where the creature was, right? Actually, I thought it looked bigger. We'll see. Gosh, so many different creatures that could come into the world. <laughs> Wow. Lights. <laughs> Always a throwback. I was laughing at the 69, the speed limit. Oh. <laughs> well, well, look who's decided to join. What are you guys doing? We're gearing up. Preparing for the hunt. Mm. And we're not killers like Eddie. And we just want to talk to him. Get him to admit his crime. Yeah, a little friendly neighborhood chat. You're not the police. So what, bad things happen when you take matters into your own hands like that? Mm -hmm. Especially when you're like in high school? <laughs> if you're not up to this, you can go home. There's no judgment. You'll still be one of us, all right? He's gonna go. He wants to, like, be cool. Yeah. I'm good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I still think there's gonna be like a moment. They're gonna find him, I feel like, at some point. They're gonna run into each other and he's gonna have to make a decision. I feel like that's Lucas's journey this season, you mm -hmm. know? Popularity or friendship? Mm -hmm. You need to find Vecna, kill him, and prove your innocence. That's all, Dustin? That's all. Listen, Eddie, I know everything that Dustin is saying sounds totally delusional, but we've actually been through this kind of thing before. <laughs> I really feel like we got this. Yeah, see, we usually rely on this girl who has superpowers, but... Uh... Those went bye bye, so uh So we're technically in in, in more of the brainstorming phase. <laughs> oh shit. Tarp. Tarp, tarp. Um I feel like you should I mean I guess you can go mm. now. Are they heading oh, to Fred's past. body? Remember it was in the middle of oh. the road. Oh. Yep. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. They're probably gonna think he did this too, to be They're honest. They're gonna be like, he's a serial killer. Cause it's like the same, you know? Mm -hmm. Did you look into Victor Creel? Sorry, what's that? Victor Creel. Wayne got an inner headed deal and did this. Victor's locked away tight, honey. You don't need to worry about him, all right? What if he got out into the upside down, like from that, prison? That's what I'm thinking, like, cause that creature is like humanoid. Miss mm -hmm. Weaver. Does the picnic table ring a bell? What if they end up getting back I together? I was literally just thinking that, you know, like, like her uh, and Steve. Like, full circle, because, you know, obviously Will, I mean, not Will, um, 
Jonathan. The brother. Jonathan, yeah. <laughs> I was like, I literally cycled through every single name. There's a lot of characters yeah, in the show. Like... <laughs> but she's still, like, keeping something secret. I want to know what he was painting. Hey, Al. Uh, I'm, I made you some Eggos, but they're getting oh, kind of... she's fixing it. After what you said at the dinner table last night, I don't think she's going to be so forgiving. I am different. I do not belong. Everyone looks at me like, like I'm a monster. Your friends don't. The way you looked at me, you you were scared of me. No, no, that's not that's that's not true. I was surprised. Maybe I was a little upset in the moment, but I mean, I'm sorry. I mean, I feel like it was a pretty human emotion. Hmm. I care for you so much. Care, but you don't you don't love me anymore. Who said that I didn't? You never say it. Mm. Mm. You can't even write it, Mike. Oh. On the letters, it's never on there. Oh. Uh... You know what I think of you. You're the most incredible person in the world. So why don't you say? Ruin us. I mean, they're nobodies. They're nobodies. Do you call them mouth breathers? <laughs> <laughs> the superhero thinks she's probably the monster right now. <gasps> that was the title. Mm-hmm. He walks. He walks. Ten bucks says mom forgot something. <laughs> yeah. I'm not taking that bet. Hi, is oh. uh, Jane Hopper lift? Oh shit. Assault. Yeah. What is this about? You may or may not be aware of an incident that happened last night involving Jane at the Rinko Mania. That was an accident. <laughs> I mean it wasn't an accident. Come on, come on, that's crazy. That doesn't need to happen. Hey there. You Jane Hopper? Oh my gosh! We didn't call Joyce. I mean, but she's like yeah. busy, so. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided. Don't say anything without a lawyer. <laughs> Eleven, will you please look at me? Everything's gonna be fine. I am going to fix this. Okay, just, just stay calm. That sucks. She got arrested. Yeah. I mean, she did like assault her in front of everybody, though. Yeah. Has mom's flight left yet? Oh, they're on the plane already. What were planes like in the 80s? Like that. Somebody you could tell smoke me. on them. <laughs> were they I like... knew that was a thing. They used oh. to have ashtrays. Ashtrays. Now they're like so there. crazy about smoking. They're like, do not smoke <laughs> in the bathroom. If you tamper, <laughs> you are going to be federally like... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I forgot. I, we just went on a plane. I yeah. saw like the sign there too. And then they they say it in the thing. They're like, "Do not attempt to like da da da." Your children bless their mischievous souls. <laughs> They're getting mischievous now. This way, what they play too much Nintendo, eat too much junk food, smoke some ganja pounds. <laughs> Speaking about your oldest. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. <laughs> So sorry to interrupt, but you're gonna need to fasten your seatbelt. <laughs> of course. <laughs> <laughs> That's some really cool, like cinematography shots. I, Is that would you call it cinematography with CGI? I feel like yes. I think so. They had some cool shots. I also like how they like do like little like throwbacks to like the era, like just like yeah. it's funny to say like okay, smoking on a plane isn't yeah. like that big of a deal, but it's like that was a thing back uh -huh. then. So the it fact that they you incorporated in the zone. it, yeah, like this is the eighties. But it I, mean, I didn't live through the eighties, feel but so, like, it feels nostalgic. Over the top, of your, like you know, like cliche eighties, mm -hmm. but it feels like. I mean, obviously, I didn't live through the eighties either. But. <laughs> Barely lived through the nineties. <laughs> My mom would know. <laughs> so I think this was the thumbnail for the, the teaser trailer. Uh, I remember yeah. seeing him with so like a shaved head. So they put him in, in this. I feel like that was too extra of a. <laughs> oh, he's learning Russian. <laughs> All I know is suka, which means bitch. It's like I'm trying to get you out of here. I mean, for a price. <laughs> Your Russian is getting better. So no, it was like a to talk. I heard from your friend. They're bringing your money to Alaska. Well, today I hope. If my pilot gets the money, then you can hitch a ride with him back to your country. <gasps> is it gonna be that easy? I mean, hopefully. His name is Yuri Ismailov. He's a smuggler. Supplies American goods to some of us guards here, including me on lucky occasions. <laughs> Cigarettes, peanut butter, playboys. <laughs> I could see why you like her, American. When I talked to her. 
I can tell by voice that she's very pretty. Feisty, too. I like that. <laughs> you miss that plane tomorrow. I am still rich. And you are still stuck in Kamchatka. Oh my gosh. You have one chance. Hit him. <laughs> Hit him so it looks like real. <laughs> Where do you want it? Oh, yes, hit him. Gotta do it. Ugh. Doesn't make sense. It's only a theory. No, Fred and Chrissy don't make sense. Why them? Yeah, the connection. They were both at the game. And near the trailer park. We're at the trailer park. Uh, should we maybe not be here? I mean, y'all were here. Fred started acting weird the second we got here. Acting weird as in... Scared. Is it the trailer park? Scared. Max said Chrissy was upset too. Chrissy was upset, yeah. I don't know about you guys, but if I saw some freaky wizard monster, I would... Maybe they did. The counselor? Mm. It was Kelly's office. I don't feel like she said that, though. You wouldn't go to the police. They never believe you. Yeah. But you might go to your, your shrink. Will she say anything, though? I doubt it. We're probably gonna have to, like, look in her records. Nancy! Nancy, where are you going? Uh, there's just something I want to check on. She's gonna go to the asylum. Flying solo with this Vecna creep on the loose? No, it's too dangerous. You need, you need someone to... He's gonna go. Oh ah! my gosh, they're setting oh! it up. They're rekindling. Is it I kind of ship it again? I mean, Which Jonathan. Which I shipped Jonathan, her and Jonathan at first, it's but so weird. it yeah, seems yeah. like they're kind of fizzling out, mm -hmm. right? I mean, I don't ship it until they break up. Mm -hmm. Us ladies, we'll stick together. No. Oh. Unless oh. you think we need you to protect us. No, I kind of shipped it. Um, maybe, maybe. Maybe it's not going that way. Maybe they're I think gone. it is. Maybe they just needed time, and now it's a good time in their, both of their lives. I don't they're know. both here. Jonathan loves that California ganja. I don't think he wants to come back yeah. <laughs> to Indiana. <laughs> <laughs> the crack. Is that like the crack, like to the portal? To a portal? It's forming one, maybe? Oh my gosh. Is it badass? I said me. Oh, he's, he's looking for spying. prey. Like who has issues maybe? Uh like yeah. Cause they said they stalked their prey. <laughs> and he can do that through the upside down. Mm, it's gotta be some combination of the freaking killer. Oh, oh yeah, that's his next victim. <sighs> oh my gosh, and he's with Lucas too. Wait, where's Lucas? He's got in the car, right? Well, 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 what do we have here? Lucas is gonna see it when it happens. Yeah. I always wanted it, El Camino. We're looking for Eddie Munson. He's in this band, if that's what you can even call this. What do you care? That's our business. Lucas? What are you doing with these douchebags? Oh, I forgot he was in the D&D mm. club. What are you gonna do? I know my sister. Oh. No! You're not being true to yourself. You're gonna get caught in the lie. Just trying to find Eddie, man. Well, you have eyes, don't you? He's not here. Mm. <gasps> oh! Lucas, Ooh, Lucas, you better make a move. You. you don't want no part of <laughs> This is a moment. gonna let it happen. I mean. Oh. Oh. It's gonna be hard to play those drums with a broken hand. That's it. What? That's it, Anderson. Oh. Uh. Oh, Crap. now you're gonna have Come a freaking chance Come on, he's here. like one of your best friends. It wasn't so hard, was it? Now, where do we find this Dustin? Lucas! Yeah, he's gonna have to choose, like, yeah. who are you truly? I'm gonna need you to give me a verbal response. Can't they not question without, like, a legal guardian? Yeah, she's like a minor. I mean, I guess if she's talking and then, like... Yeah, they're not going to be like, sorry, we can't go... Like, you yeah. know, they'll be like, do it. But you... I don't know. Yeah. You don't know? Shouldn't be a thing. Lawyer, legal guardian <laughs> with a minor. Did you know that? No. She doesn't seem that upset about it, does she? No, she doesn't. Did you want to kill her? Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Stop maybe, talking, Elle! But... I don't know. As you're oh, no, I didn't say that. Say. That's not what you're supposed to say. <laughs> no. I plead the fifth. <laughs> That's uh, why you need a lawyer. No. 
No, you didn't want to kill her. No, you don't know. I don't know. Mm. You're digging yourself into a hole right now. Dang it. Is she like actually gonna go into like She's five six? Oh wow, she's almost my height. Okay, yes, I see. I don't that. know why I thought she was way shorter. I'm five seven. Probably because she was younger before. <laughs> It means they're putting her in the system, after which point she'll be transferred to juvenile hall. What? Jail. You're gonna put her in jail. So she really is going away. Without her legal guardian ever knowing at I all? Know. That seems weird. Mm -hmm. I have to wait for mom to land in Alaska, but I think she's just gonna be sitting in jail? Yeah, I don't know. I'm oh. Hey! Hey, Mike! Hey, stop it! Uh. Oh! That sucks for her! Yeah. Joyce is come, gonna come back and be like, <laughs> There's like a part of me that feels like her powers are gonna come back in like juvie. Maybe Hopper will come back and get her out of jail. <laughs> I feel like by the time they get back, that's if everything goes right, yeah. which I just feel like something's gonna be a hiccup, you know? How much longer? Oh, just a few more hours, almost there. <laughs> you and your husband have exciting plans. Oh. <laughs> Seeing an old friend. How fun. <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's goopy. Is that biscuits and gravy? I think it's chicken. <gasps> Make friends. Yeah, I need to <laughs> With the bread? What? Yeah. He wants to get hit? Oh. Just to be a little mate. Even I don't fully understand what he's trying to say. Like, hit his leg or hit his shackle? Pleasure. Both? Okay, well, I mean, if you're gonna get out, then... Just some American. Oh, like with that thing. Mm. Oh, it's gonna... Can't make a noise. Is it gonna hit the foot? He's trying to break it, I think. Yeah, but it's indirectly hitting his foot. Do it again, do it again! <laughs> uh, how can he not make a noise? Like, that's freaking... I mean, determination. <laughs> Gotta get out of here. Okay. Oh my gosh, we're going. Victor committed the eyeball murders way back in the 50s. It's eyeball murders. Speaking of eyeball, she has an eyeball on her. <laughs> <laughs> That means these murders predate uh, 11 and the Upside Down by about 30 years. Yeah. Which makes spooky Victor Creel like 70 years old. Hey, 70 could kill. <laughs> <laughs> so she's at the library, right? Like trying to find records of him? Like, don't they have like local newspapers and stuff mm -hmm. like that at the library and stuff? Sorry, we're in a bit of a rush. Could we get the keys to the basement archives? Of course. Give me one sec. Did I come off mean or condescending or something? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It's just you seem annoyed. You don't know me very well. I don't really have a filter or a strong grasp of social cues. <laughs> <laughs> All right, ladies, here you go. Have fun. Yep, we'll try. Robin needs to be a wing woman right now and start mm -hmm. propping up Steve. <laughs> Do you have a minute to talk? Um, yeah, of course, of course. I mean, I don't feel like you're gonna get her to say anything about her. Sorry, talk about what? Nancy? Your temporary insanity earlier today when you basically threw yourself at Nance. Ah, he caught it. Oh, that's not what happened. Pretty sure okay. that's what happened. I mean, y'all were dating. Yeah. You know. You've matured so much since then. I'm just dating. And you're... as it relates to your steadfast refusal to date Robin, it's pretty much the only logical explanation. I mean... But he doesn't know. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay I forgot. for Nance. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was like, She only told him. Yeah. <laughs> Anderson, okay? okay? I don't want to find her in the morning with her eyes sucked out of the front of her skull by this Vecna creep. <laughs> You're like bright red in the face right now. <laughs> I want to talk about it. I'll punch you so hard in your face that your teeth will fall back out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the face! <laughs> His face got so serious. Not cool. Sorry. Aww. Aww. <laughs> They're That's friends. That's subject. <laughs> That's still like my favorite like yeah, little duo, bromance. Yeah. <laughs> You've experienced trauma. So now when it rains, it storms. Yeah, I know. Do you think you're ready to talk more? She has a key necklace. About that night? It's the key to the basement. 
Can I just get mm -hmm. like, Attack on Titan? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> not the time, Casey. Not the time. Mm -hmm. Where it happened? I'm sorry. Your weed came out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what if there was a serial killer on the loose in my neighborhood? Did Chrissy mention anything? So that's your angle. I mean, they were. It was right there by where she lived. The police totally have this under control. <laughs> Can I use the bathroom? Sure. She could like steal files or something. I mean, where would she even keep? I feel them? like they would be at school, right? If anything. Well, actually, I don't know. <gasps> oh, but like maybe for oh, her desk. Yeah. yeah. The keys for the school. Office. I would have said something. Did she just leave? Steve, drive. Oh my god. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> Where the hell is Sinclair? Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Kids, where the hell have you been? Just listen. Are you guys looking for Eddie? Yeah, and we found him. No thanks to you. You found him? He's at a boathouse on Cold. Oh no! Oh. You better not, Lucas. Eddie tried to save Chrissy. Then why do all the cops say he did it? Lucas, you're so behind. It's ridiculous. Okay. <laughs> I don't think he would sell them out. I can't. I hope not. I think some real bad shit's about to go down. I think he's just warning them. Shit. Oh fuck. Don't say anything. Don't say anything. I, I broke in. <laughs> I was I was looking for clues. Clues? What? Freshman think he's Sherlock Holmes or something? <laughs> <laughs> I found one. No. Lucas! Lucas. After everything. Don't fucking say the boathouse. You. I know where Eddie's hiding. Son of a bitch! Be misleading. No. Please be misleading. He's not. It's gonna have to. The moment's gonna have to present itself. I feel like for Lucas, and he's gonna have to like make the ultimate choice right there. But he just keeps making the wrong Screw decisions the right jocks. now. Screw the stupid jocks. Who have you been through life or death with? Those are your true friends. But he won a championship with them. <laughs> <laughs> That's all there is is basketball. I say as I played basketball. Ball is life. <laughs> I play volleyball too. Volleyball was more Wait, fun. Oh shit, this is like the third. Are they like after him? Oh, yeah, they yeah. Are, yeah. I feel like that could have been an easier way to do this, but whatever. I mean, she's out in the middle of nowhere. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh. Oh shit. They're not gonna work. Oh, here he is. Is he doing this by himself, though? Hey, kiddo. Like, with just, just his connections? I don't feel like it. Come on, we're here. Huh? I could never sleep on a flight. Yeah, me neither. Can't really sleep. Oh, the money is fucking out of the bag. Back when you used to be able to just get off the plane, like, you didn't have to go through the airport. Mm -hmm. Or the TSA. Yeah. I don't think they even had TSA back then, did they? I don't think so. Your chains? I mean, he's got to have them, like, kind of, like... Like, partial. Yeah. <laughs> Do a shitty check. How did he do that though? Did he like put it back on somehow? Like Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. Is it so I can slide over? Oh, That's what it is! Fuck. I didn't realize that what it was. Uh, I thought he was just trying to. Break I did the chain, too, but know. I guess it was so that it made it like. So that it's easier to slip. Oh, oh my god, that's so gonna get infected. <laughs> Wouldn't that make it swell more? Like make it harder to lift off? I mean, if it's broken, I guess. You I know, guess, yeah. That that would be pliable. it. Oh my gosh, that makes it so much worse. Oh, Creel. Big waste of time, and you're obviously bored. So why don't you just call Steve? I'm sure he'll come pick you up. And I mean, I'm not really in danger here, so. Does she think that they're a thing? Hmm. I mean, they're always hanging out together. Mm. They work together. I do know that Steve and I are like totally not. Yeah. Right? 
What? Okay. Wing woman. Can I remind you that we are looking for information on dark wizards? If someone's gonna write about that, it's gonna be these weirdos. Ah, Elvis, cloned by aliens. <laughs> Victor Creel claims vengeful demon killed family. Demon? Oh. Could he have just, like, gone down for it? Hmm. But it wasn't actually him? Kind of like how they're trying to do with Eddie. Uh-huh. That's the house, right? That he's yeah. in the upside down. Yeah. Yeah. Demon from his home. Pretty novel for the 50s. Exorcist wasn't even out yet. Keep going. Oh my gosh. Victor Creel might actually be innocent. Victor claimed this exorcism failed, but it angered this demon, which then murdered his family, removing their eyes. <gasps> Victor believed he was spared as a punishment. Oh, that's pretty convenient for Victor. Or an excuse, you know, to like pin it on you. Wait, what are you doing? Breaking and entering into school to retrieve some <laughs> confidential and extremely personal files. <laughs> Like a mini water gate or something. <laughs> water gate? <laughs> a second, didn't those guys get caught? Holy shit. Found it? Yeah, and not just Chrissy's file. Fred was seeing Miss Kelly too. Oh, Fred! Oh, because of the car accident. Uh huh. Make the connection. And hopefully, Eddie got the fuck out of here. And Patrick and Andy, you split up. Go around this way. Me and Sinclair, we keep going. And we flank his ass from both sides. Maybe Vecna will take out the other guy right now mm -hmm. and that'll freak him the hell out, you know? Mm hmm. Then you'll know it wasn't Eddie. Mm hmm. You know? I mean, will they make the connection? The, the but <laughs> I'm really just more concerned for Eddie's safety right now, more so than anything. Yeah. Like, we don't have a connection to this other guy. <laughs> It's probably gonna get taken out by Vecna. Am I in trouble? For the roller skate thing? No, 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 no. <laughs> Hawkins is in danger. You have fought this evil before and you've won. But this evil, it's like a virus. She doesn't have her powers anymore. Yeah. Can you help? <laughs> a war is coming to Hawkins. You're sure Eddie was here? Yeah, I'm, I'm positive. Let's check around the back. Around the back! Where's Reefer Rick? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you were the only one who might have a shot to hit this thing so hard it can't get back up. I don't have my powers. What if I told you there was a way? A way to bring them back. Hey, How did you even know? How did you even know like that mm. she didn't even have a What happened after know? the helicopter left? Come. So I've been preparing. Oh. Okay. Developing how okay. you restore your abilities. Oh. Secret files. Potential to not just bring them back, but bring them back stronger than before. She's gonna be a freaking Avenger. I think you are the cause. I believe they're wrong. Okay. I believe you're the cure. Yes. But you should know there is a very real possibility. Are they gonna find out that she was lying too? And if it does, you will never see your friends again. My friends. And Hawkins, are they in danger? Probably everyone's in danger. You may feel you need to go to them now, but if you do, you will risk everything. Risk everyone. She's having headaches. Oh my gosh, she's he's stalking her. Oh fuck. Oh my gosh, cause she lost Billy like that. Oh, Nightmare, no, son no, of a bitch! No, I didn't expect that. Past trauma. So she, like, trauma is what die it is. Traumatically in front of you. Hate to not be okay. Max. It's easy for you to say right now. Max. Oh my god! She's seeing something. What if I'm the monster? I don't know you that well, but I know you have spent too much of your life being told what to do by people like me. You're the hero, L. Come with me now. Find out for yourself. That's a massive Try sandwich. Try and get the waffles. <laughs> Are they picking them up too? I guess they're here. <laughs> it's gonna be about Max. Oh my gosh. I totally did not see that coming. Mm. Ugh. It's gonna be there and gonna be like, meh. 
Oh wait, it's the clock. <laughs> oh, fuck. oh god. <laughs> oh. Damn. <laughs> Scary. So, so much stuff is going on right now. Where do you want to start? Like, which character? Like, I feel like there's so many different things right now. I feel um, like the big thing is Max. Max? Yeah. I honestly did not see that coming at all. Yeah, I, as soon as I saw headaches, I was kind of thinking, because, you know, they mentioned the headaches, and, like, when they showed nightmares, I was like, okay, well, now it's, it's kind of worrisome, and obviously she's a target. I don't know... Does he like stalk multiple people at the same time? It kind of seems like it because the other guy's having the mm -hmm. nose bleeding and whatnot. So he's a target as well too. So we don't really know like her time frame, you know, like how much time do we have? I'd imagine, you know, time is of the essence. Dr. Owens made his return here. Uh, he is recruited 11. He thinks he has a possibility to get her powers back. So. I'm curious, like, what exactly that process will be because how did they, he even know how she lost her powers? Yeah, I'm kind of asking like that, that same question had myself. Lost well, her powers. or maybe did she he just tell, anticipated. Well, this he helped to relocate them, so maybe, maybe, maybe yeah. it was communicated to him in that, like, you know, time frame. I'm assuming, but like, we're, I'm going to skip over that right now because even though that seems like you know that's kind of like the big play to take out uh, Vecna. I just feel like, you know, that's probably going to be like, you know, long term of the mm -hmm. season thing right now. Another thing that's going on right now, which I'm just completely disappointed in Lucas, like the fact that he gave up Eddie, like it's so disappointing to me. Well, and we gave up his location. Uh, they're in the process of looking for him right now. I still feel like he's going to have an opportunity to redeem himself, but I think actually what could kind of not solve or alleviate the issue, but what could stall the issue is the other basketball player that's having his nose bleed if Vecna comes after him like while they're in the process of like hunting for Eddie and then all of a sudden you know he starts getting elevated and his limbs start snapping and his eyeballs pop out of his head maybe that might scare him enough to just like you know forget the whole Eddie thing and maybe that might give Eddie a, a chance to get away if they even find Eddie which I feel like they're gonna find him at this point so another thing that's going on is I feel like Steve and Nancy might rekindle their relationship they're alluding to it i think i mean yeah. it seems like her and jonathan are kind of fizzling out a little bit yeah. um i mean and that's okay you know like i mean they moved apart so it's kind of hard to expect them to like upkeep this relationship especially when they, it doesn't seem like they want the same things anymore yeah um but i mean steve is there and like lives in the same town and as i her. feel like steve's grown a lot yeah too, so mm -hmm. i feel like he's a different steve and like i'm i'm rooting for it too right now which yeah it's kind of funny i <laughs> we at one point rooted for yeah. her and jonathan to yeah. be a thing and now like okay they're not a thing anymore okay yeah, now let's like, go for her and steve, steve again go back to your yeah. first love <laughs> also joyce and murray are in the process of getting the money to the pilot to be able to get hopper free i feel like it's gonna happen i feel like there's probably gonna be some sort of hiccup that we're mm -hmm. not foreseeing right now because i feel like that's just good storytelling you know like nothing is ever as easy as it seems but with that I eventually feel like, you know, we're going to get Hopper back because I feel like, you know, you're not just going to have him be revealed to be alive mm -hmm. and then to like not be able to get out of the situation. What's that going to do for Elle? I, I imagine it's going to be helpful. Like, I feel like, you know, she's been going through a lot right now. I still am curious, like I mentioned earlier, like what Dr. Owen's going to be able to do to be able to get her powers back. And also... I, I'm just getting this feeling. I'm just throwing it out there. I might be completely wrong and off base, but I think Will likes Mike. Like, I don't know. I think that they've alluded to st some stuff before when Elle was talking about like him drawing like on like his little paper, whatever he wanted to give to Mike. He was super excited. And he was also super disappointed when um, he, she, he took off, Mike took off to Elle with the Egos. And then he also retracted when that girl was trying to like, I was gonna say advance on him, but like put her put her leg on his leg. He kind of like retracted and went like this. I just have a feeling that that might be a thing. All right, well thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't already, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell so you can stay notified for our future videos. Also head over to our Patreon if you wanna see our full length reactions to this series. We upload them over there. The link's down in the description below. Okay, we'll see you next time. Bye everyone.